Welcome back. Now, it can be overwhelming as a senior to consider moving from your home to a residential care facility, but it can help when you get perspective from someone who has already been there. Jean Hameroff, who wrote a series of articles for the Saddlebrook newspaper on this subject, has turned the columns into a helpful book, and he joins us now along with Frank McGee. Gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Thank you. Now, Gene, as we said, you used to write articles weekly for Saddlebrook newspaper. That's great. Right. What made you decide to make all of these articles into your new book? Well, the, the editor of the paper, as I was moving to the independent living facility, she says, Gene, why don't you write a, have a, a process of the steps that you take to get to the final decision? And so I moved in. And I kept a diary every day, and it, it turned out to be 12 different <coughs> events, starting with how do you find the place, what to look for in the tours, uh, uh, comparing the cost of living in your home to the cost of getting a facility, and it goes all the way through then how to live in the, in the, in the uh, facility. And what's happened is a lot of people have had a career and they are so busy their whole lifetimes, they move into a facility and they've got all this free time. And it has been a challenge for a lot of people that, uh, that, that moved into, but it's wonderful. And I was very happy there. And the cover says I found happiness, an independent living facility, and it's just worked out fine. Is that why you thought there was a, a need to make a book so that others can read it and exactly. get some insight? So the editor, uh, when I had such a response, we had a great response on the book, on the, on the articles, and everyone told me that it was helpful. That was the key word, helpful, <laughs> making a decision. And my partner, Frank McGee, I did the writing of the book, and he helped publish the book. Uh, and it's a self-publishing book and it's not for sale now. Well, excellent. Frank, it sounds like, you know, we needed you to accomplish this amazing book as well. What would you say is the major theme? Well, I think that the theme is probably that everybody knows somebody older that they care about and, and everybody is thinking what's going to happen to this older person if they have to make a move. and. Uh, the, I think Gene is very conversational in, in the story, and he talks about the emotional ups and downs, which everybody has, all the things from where did I, where's the dining room, all the things that people might be looking for. And most of the people who have put endorsements on the book have been professional people in the, in the field of, of uh, senior care, and they say it's pretty valuable in their hands. Well, Jean, have you, have you always been a writer, or what was your, your career path before getting into this book in the columns? Well, it was, a, it was a tough move, that's what you're asking, and it took me a year to make a decision. My sweet daughter-in-law said, Jean, how many 90-year-old people do you know that live alone? And I thought about it, and there weren't very many. And that was sort of the convincing factor of, of making the move. And I've been very happy there. And uh, it, it's, just, it's been a tremendous transition uh, at this period of time. And as soon as we finish this one, we'll start another book. OK. Oh, wow. <laughs> so we already have something else in, in, oh, yeah. in the yeah. thoughts and oh, words. Yeah. Well, it seems like a very good partnership. Now, of course, I know our viewers at home watching want to know where can they get this book? <clears throat> There's a website, makethemovebook.com, and it's available also on Amazon. On the website, there's some background of Gene's life, which is pretty fascinating and uh, explains why he is who he is and uh, why people respond very much to his, the demeanor in the book, the way he writes. And I know, Gene, you're going to be having a book signing, which we're going to tell everybody about here uh, shortly. And I'm sure people can't wait to tell you how much they appreciate right. the book. Our first, first book signing was very successful. We had standing room only. It was just great. And uh, the next one is going to be at Atria 
May 23rd uh, at 3 p.m. in the afternoon. And we're inviting the whole county to come in if they, like, <laughs> if they would like to come in. Well, they will definitely be happy to meet you, I'm sure. Thank you both so much for coming Thank today you. and telling us about this book. Thank you. Our pleasure. Thank you so much. Absolutely. And Jean is having that book signing and meet and greet event on Saturday, May 23rd at Atria Campana del Rio. That is at 1550 East River Road starting at 3 p.m. For more information on the book or to purchase yours, visit MakeTheMoveBook.com.